One of the reasons why Vasily Machenko and Guillermo Ringo now are able to befuddle their opponents is because of their incredible footwork. For the first time in their professional careers, they'll be taking on someone that can match their own. So the question is, who has the better footwork? Guillermo Ringo now prefers to use his in order to move around the ring and lull opponents into making mistakes. He likes to walk around or glide side to side in order to hypnotize his opponent before unleashing an attack. He can also circle away from aggressive opponents or sidestep when he feels confident. Rigadal can also stand in front of his opponents and dart in and out of the way. He can also leap to the sides or pivot away while managing to stay close to his foes. One thing that Rigadal likes to do is to duck and slip punches, keep his head in that position before galloping away. This allows him to change levels before slipping out of the way. Lomachenko, for his part, can also step in and out or leap to the sides. He can also use lateral movement or circle from afar in order to frustrate his opponent. Of course, Lomachenko's claim to fame is his use of quick pivots that he uses not only to defend but to create attacking opportunities. While Lomachenko could fight all of his bouts like Rigondeau, he has chosen instead to be more aggressive. He's not the best at cutting off the ring, but he does a pretty good job of pressuring fighters, of maintaining the distance, and of cornering foes once they are worn down. So who has the better footwork? We'll leave you with this little montage and you can tell us in the comment section. As always, don't forget to like and subscribe and we will see you on the next one.